Rosemary Teeter. At least that's what the name badge says. <laughs> I have a lot of before. Mm -hmm. Okay. I've been um, in the nursing profession. I've been in mass transit. I've been tra travel and tourism, local government, um, and high tech construction safety. Mm -hmm. um, and, and they all kind of folded into what I'm doing here. First, I was a student. Mm -hmm. um, I did my bachelor's degree kind of upside down. During that period of time, I realized that this is the place for people who have the compulsion to explain. I have the compulsion to explain. Mm -hmm. I got grief for years about it from my family. Mm -hmm. And one day, I was literally trudging, head down, just walking purposefully, grumble, 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 there must be some place in the world for someone who has to explain things. I was walking along the side of McLaughlin, and I literally, it's a, it's a picture-perfect moment, stopped in mid-step, looked around me and realized, this is it. This is where pe they understand people who need to explain things. So my goal was to be here somehow or other after I finished my bachelor's degree, and I did that, and then I came back um, with my master's so I could teach. I teach for the skills development department, um, GED and adult basic ed, and reading uh, pre-college reading classes, skills, um, study skills, and for the um, counseling and advising department, I sometimes teach classes like values clarification and that sort of thing. Here for as long as I hold up. Um, I like working here. I like what I do here. It's worth getting up in the morning. And I haven't been able to say that about every job I've had. In fact, not most of them. But it's worth it to be here, to keep coming back. I could work another 10 years, probably. Um, I probably won't ever completely retire. I Even when I have time off, I don't sit still much. So. In the future, I'd like to be here doing more of the same. Watching the light bulb come on. Yeah. That and getting to clap for people at graduation mm -hmm. is the other big thrill. Getting for, to clap for people at graduation, walking across the stage. The one I had in my GED class who came in, I hate math, you can't teach me math. Yeah. Got her GED. Mm -hmm. Getting to oh, clap really? for her as she walked across the stage. There's absolutely wow. nothing like it. Yep. Keeps me coming back. She's very interesting and she teaches her class with a lot of energy that the students can get involved and also be energetic by just coming there and enjoying the class time. Because she seems like a very open person and um, she seems like that she will not judge you who you are but actually listen to your problem and maybe help you to you know, solve them or put you in the right track. She has helped me become a better reader and improve my vocab, which I'm very thankful because I think it will help me out later in life.